Thanks for joining us. I'm Tiffany Chan with a WBZ News update. Our top stories. Police in Lynn are investigating a second deadly shooting in as many days. Investigators say they got a 911 call at around 11 o'clock last night saying someone had been shot on Lincoln Street. Officers found a man inside with gunshot wounds who later died at the hospital. This comes just one day after one person was killed and six others wounded in a shooting on Essex Street in Lynn. Boston University police are issuing a crime alert during move in week after three burglaries on Bay State Road. Two of them happened early yesterday morning. Police say in both incidents, a person gained access through an open window and stole some items. Another incident happened back on August 22nd. Anyone with information is asked to reach out to BU police and four Boston City Councilors are urging that a state of emergency be declared over the area known as Mass and Cass. Council President Ed Flynn, along with Councilors Michael Flaherty, Aaron Murphy, and Frank Baker have all signed the letter. All are asking the Boston Public Health Commission to declare a state of emergency. They say it will give the city more flexibility to respond to the ongoing issues there, including substance abuse and human trafficking. Now let's get a check of the forecast with meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff. Hi, Jacob. Hi, Tiffany. We do have a ton of sunshine in the forecast for the day today. It's what we see on our satellite and radar. And importantly, we are staying dry. The good news, too, for those of you that love summer, we have a summer feel in the air over the next few days. We do have a lot of sunshine around today, mid to upper 80s for our highs, feeling more like the low 90s at times. Inland is where we'll see the warmest temperatures, mid to upper 80s. The cool spots will be the Cape and Islands with an onshore wind. We're going to see temperatures stuck in the 70s. Tomorrow we're back into the upper 80s, again feeling like 90 plus degree temperatures when you factor in the warmer temperatures and the increase in humidity. We could actually see some heat advisories issued for tomorrow and beyond. We have that warmth sticking around for Tuesday, Wednesday, and into Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. We have a chance for some showers. Tiffany? Looking forward to the sunshine. Thank you, Jacob. I'm Tiffany Chan, and this has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day.